of the business document management uh, workspace, uh, which has been initially uh, designed to allow you to um, change the layout of templates uh, using to produce uh, business documents in the Microsoft Office format. For example, uh, you can generate the free text invoices reporting forms using such a template. And in addition to that, now you can not only modify the layout of such templates, but you can also add new fields uh, to such a template and specify what data will be populated to this field at runtime. Let's modify the template using to produce uh, this kind of reports by adding a new field uh, that will place to the header of this report the company website address. We'll open the business document management workspace and start editing our template. We'll put it in there. And uh, to enter a new field, we need to open this panel and start entering a new field. Here, uh, we need to select the enter at field type since uh, we don't expect to have any nested uh, elements under the enter at field. We'll select the cell type. And uh, as you can see here, <clears throat> the last updated cell or range uh, of the template will be considered as a placeholder for the entered field, and it will be highlighted. Then, we need to enter the name of the new field and continue this process. The enter field will be added to the template structure as well as uh, it will be added to the Excel template. So now we need to specify <coughs> the data source that will be used to uh, populate data to the enter field. So what we need to do, uh, we need to find the appropriate data source available uh, for the current template. And uh, when we found it, we'll click Paint and save our changes. So now we can use our modified template to generate free text invoice forms and see how our changes affects the generated document. As you can see now, it shows the company website address, uh, which comes from the company settings. Uh, if you want uh, to get more details about this feature, you can just visit this wiki page and review it. Thank you.